Okay guys, so I was going to show my antenna and see if anyone knew if I was doing it like right or if anyone knows how to make one better than the way I've made it. So, so far what I have right now is just a wire. It's uh, copper strands, that kind of strands. Oh, let me focus. That kind of wire. They just wrapped around the, uh, the antenna of the shortwave radio right now. And then I have it going into this electric fence wire here, where it attaches right there. And then I have a ground wire, which is this one here, that goes down to this pole, just wrapped around it a bunch, and then it's down in the dirt. And then I have it following this wire, and this wire goes down this metal fence line. I figured the, the metal fence line probably isn't the greatest way to do it, but... And then also, I have power lines over top of it, so I'm just doing all sorts of wrong, but it works better than it does with just the regular antenna. So, and then this wire here goes down to the end of the fence down there as far as you can see. It goes left till about over there somewhere it stops. And it just stops. It's not into anything. It's not grounded anywhere except for right over there. What I showed you. So, uh, I'm not sure how long it is, but it's I know it's pretty long to the end of this fence row. And down there it turns and goes left along that uh, sidewalk over there and goes down to that corner. And then a little ways up this fence line here to where those trees are, where the leaves are, about right there, and this stops. So. I know it'd probably help if I went to one of these trees up here. Stayed away with, from these power lines, obviously. <laughs> but, yeah. I could run it out my other window and go to a tree that's like over there, but that'd be a lot of work to get it off the ground. My parents probably wouldn't like that either, so. So for right now, this is what my antenna looks like that I'd show everyone. Alright, thanks for watching.